Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel. Friends, today we are going to discuss mechanism of fatigue failure. So, this mechanism of fatigue failure will consist of four stages. Stage number one, stage number two, stage number three and stage number four. The first stage is the nucleation of the crack. Nucleation of crack. That is the starting of the crack. In this stage, a crack will start at the point of discontinuity. As we know that friend, no component is totally perfect. There will be flaws in the component and there will be discontinuities. Discontinuities in the component, there will be defects, sharp corners. All these things will contribute toward the stress raising that is due to these discontinuities the stress in neighborhood of these continuities will increase that is the stress will increase in the neighborhood of these discontinuities so these discontinuities will act as the an starting point for the failure of the component so whenever a fluctuating load is applied on the component and there is a discontinuity in the component then it will lead to the nucleation of the crack that is initiation of the crack so suppose this is a discontinuity very minute discontinuity in this component and at this continued discontinuity the stress will raise okay due to this there will be a crack growth so the second space is the crack growth crack growth because of this discontinuity so this tiny tiny very tiny uh, nucleation of the crack spot will turn into a site of crack growth and crack growth will crack growth will be in this direction so because of the uh, loading which is continuing which is continue to act on the component the crack will start growing in this direction as the loading loading continues the crack will will grow in this direction as shown here now friend the next stage is the crack grow to a small size now in this stage the crack was not visible actually but it was internal now what will happen in the next stage it will become visible visible growth of crack as it is clear from the stage number 3 as shown here in the stage number 3 the crack is visible and it is propagating in this direction so this is a very dangerous situation and it will lead to the fracture so the fourth stage is the fracture that is the component will break into two parts and if the loading continues then this will happen that is the stage fourth will be applicable in that case so in this stage the material will fail and will be broken into two component so this was all for the mechanism of the fatigue failure that is the initiation of the crack okay that is the nucleation of the crack near the discontinuity and the crack will start growing in this direction and there is a visible growth of the crack in the third stage and in the last stage the material will fracture so friend this was all for today's topic I hope you will like my video and if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel. So thank you friend for watching my video.